Well, good evening. Uh, tonight we're looking at Tropical Storm Irma, positioned over southern Georgia. Now, even though the storm is positioned over southern Georgia at this time, we're seeing a lot of the rainfall further north over the Tennessee Valley. And then by, let's say, tomorrow, around, let's say, 2 p.m., much of the rain will be further west than that over places like Alabama and Mississippi. Um, and much of the rainfall, the heavy rainfall at least, will be done at that time. Storm totals we're seeing maybe around 3 inches of rain in these areas, if not less. However, what we need to really pay attention to is, let's say in the western Carolinas, near Asheville, we could see rainfall totals of around 3 to 5 inches in those areas. And then as you head further north and east across Virginia, generally 1 to 2 inches of rain, if not less. And the last thing we need to take a look at is to the south and east with Hurricane Jose. Hurricane Jose could pose a threat by early next week. Now, if we look at this particular image, this is the GFS model as of 11 p.m. next Monday on the 18th. Again, this is a week out, so as far as it posing a threat to, let's say, the states of North Carolina and Virginia at this time, a lot remains in question. Will there be more wind shear? Will it be caught up in a front? So many different factors we got to take a look at. But as of right now, if we were to look at, let's say, the potential strength of this storm, especially along the eastern edge of the eye wall, we could see wind speeds close to 110 miles per hour at this time next week. Again, Category 2 storm, if not a Category 3. Again, a lot remains to be answered, but this will be a storm we need to look at in the coming days. So just to kind of summarize what we talked about earlier, Irma will deliver tropical storm conditions to Alabama and Mississippi on Wednesday before being downgraded to a tropical depression. And then later in the week, we'll focus on Jose, which could be a potential Category 3 storm as it approaches the southeast coast early next week. Again, if you're in Virginia, places like North Carolina, be on the lookout.